Nobody likes the idea of things being removed from their favourite games, but sometimes you just have to consider the options of whether or not something is becoming outdated and maybe it's coming up to time to say goodbye to it or at least a rework for it. Today you guys we're going to talk about Davinia Park's future and what I believe is going to be happening going forward. Hey little means, we're aiming to get to 150,000 subscribers. Don't forget to click that sub button and I hope you enjoy today's video. Hello wonderful little means, my name is B and welcome back to a new right video. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today as always and if you are, please don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell so you never miss any of my daily bro hype videos and to help us to get closer to hitting 150,000 subscribers on this channel. You guys, I know that you're all going to be excited about whatever future realms and future updates we get in bro high but as new things release in the game older things become more and more outdated and more and more redundant today i was thinking a lot about davinia park you guys this wonderful realm that we've all come to love and cherish of course we've all spent lots of time inside of this beautiful realm and over the last year as well there's been plenty of updates in here including the valentine's update releasing inside of davinia park and of course also the easter update releasing inside of davinia park but with that all in mind, you guys, you've probably noticed that the devs are now prioritizing more focus on releasing new updates instead in their own individual realms, which of course means that Divinia Park has become somewhat redundant. The only actual reason to come to Divinia Park now is for the Fountain of Dreams, given that obviously inside of a Royal High, you no longer need to come to Divinia Park to read obviously the update log, because it is in the menu when you first join the game. The problem as well, you guys, is that you don't don't actually need to come to Davinia Park to use the fountain because it is in Diamond Beach as well and is usually added to whatever seasonal update comes out. So in reality you guys you've got no real reason to want to come to Davinia Park unless maybe you just haven't claimed some of the really old chests. So this had me thinking you guys. Is Davinia Park a sustainable realm for the future? Is there really going to be any reason to keep it in the future, especially if the Fountain of Dreams moves into the new school? I've been thinking long and hard about this, you guys, especially since Davinia Park really doesn't have anything going on in it anymore. There's nothing to play in here and no real reason to want to come. So is there likely going to be a Davinia Park in the future? Do we think Davinia Park will stay? Well, given that Davinia itself was removed and replaced with Davinia Park, you guys, I don't think it's impossible for Davinia Park to also be removed and replaced with something else in the future. But I do think it would be more likely that Davinia Park might see some more reworks. As you guys know, up until this year, Davinia Park literally had not been updated for a long time. It was still Easter themed for ages and it took a while before they changed it up. But it has actually had some reworks and some redesigns over the last few months, particularly because of the updates that have featured inside of it, including Easter, Valentine, and also the April Fool's update that was linked in here as well. It was a really good time, you guys, with lots of updates in Davinia. But of course, ever since then, it has obviously gone and there's not really anything in here for you to do anymore. So you guys, I do think that Davinia Park's lifespan is limited. I don't think it will be around forever. I think there's a really good chance that the devs could say goodbye to it soon. And I think that once it does become time to say goodbye to it, some of you might be sad about that. But obviously, Davinia Park, obviously like most realms, does have a limited lifespan in the game. Now, it is one of the most updated realms though. There are some textures in here that are older but a lot of the things in here are newer things that obviously we don't see in older realms like Enchantix or Fantasia so I don't think its lifespan is limited immediately I don't think it's gonna go anytime soon but I do think it is possible that Davinia Park may be removed in the future I'd really love to know your thoughts on this though little bean so let me know in the comments what you're thinking but I definitely think at some point Davinia Park could be removed now you guys I wanted to talk to you about something really really important really quick because a lot of you guys may not have noticed is this but if any of you do I don't want you to be confused by it so I just wanted to talk to you super super fast about something that has happened with my channels just so that you guys are aware of it and aren't wondering about it I don't want any of you to be panicking and curious I want something that I'm going to tell you right now to be really nice and clear so all of you are aware of it some of you may have noticed that a couple of my channels have swapped around and what I mean by that is because it sounds quite confusing you guys may have noticed that some of the names have changed the reason why you guys is 
is because my role player channel is now going to be the adopt me channel that I used to have that used to be called B plays because it is a brand new channel you guys with no content on it except Roblox so I feel like it makes the most sense for that one to be the one that we utilize to obviously post lots of things on that are Roblox related and then my other channel which used to be my role player one with the 31,000 subscribers is now just called B plays because that one's going to be our mixed game one you guys where I upload Roblox and maybe play some Minecraft on too mainly because that channel has also had other games on it before if you go over to the B plays channel now you guys will see obviously 31,000 subscribers it's this channel here with the blue picture obviously I have posted some role play things on here before but if you guys do scroll back you'll be able to see that I have had Minecraft on here I've had other games on here over the years so it kind of just makes sense that this one is the one that we utilize to post other things on it since obviously other games have been posted on there too and it just makes sense I feel like for me to link these games in since I have posted other games on this channel before. Then this channel the, the pink icon is now called B plays roleplay and this one had my adopt me stuff on it you guys and this one's gonna have my roleplay on it from now on so hopefully that makes sense the links are all below if you want to go subscribe. If you are on this channel right now, my B Plays Roblox channel, go over to channels, you guys, and click that, and you'll be able to see my vlog channel, my roleplay channel, and my B Plays channel. And you can click subscribe on any of them to make sure you stay up to date with that content. I'd really love it if you guys gave my other content a chance as well. So please do consider it. It really would mean a lot to me. Thanks so much for watching this video today, little beans. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a great day. Goodbye, everyone. See you soon.